Hey everybody, check this out. First charges filed for gold theft. This gentleman here allegedly uh, stole and laundered uh, $200 million in gold bars. So he has uh, connections and uh, pretty good at, say, getting rid of money that's illegally gotten. Something like that. Okay. Well, one thing a lot of people about involved in the case probably aren't aware of is he's probably way more nervous than you think. How many people do you think are named Archer? I don't think there's that many, and I've only ever heard of one. So anyways, if you watch the Scam Baiter shows, uh, Jim Browning, uh, Scammer Payback, uh, Scam Baiter, any of those, they caught a gentleman named Archer with uh, scam call, Scammer Call Centers. Uh, you know where they phone the elderly and they rob them of thousands of dollars? And, uh, and, you know, they don't care if they're starving to death and no medicine or losing their home, dying from uh, no money. It, it didn't matter. They just robbed it. So if, if this is the same archer and they uh, watch these scam baiter shows and they find out that this is the same archer, then he's uh, responsible for like the robbery of, say, 20, 30,000 elderly people. Now, a couple things about elderly people. It's a different charge for robbing elderly people. It's an added charge for elderly, robbing elderly people. And on top of that, you know what elderly people have? Families. And you know what this gentleman probably has? Is a family. So this gentleman is now in Canada. And if this is the same guy, this guy's in jail in Canada and he got your money. Now imagine his family's here in Canada and they got your money. So come see him. Uh, come see the police. Have him charged. Come get your money. Sue his family for their money. You think he's nervous in jail. And you know, the thing about jail is uh, all these people that have been robbed and all that, they got family. You know what f families have? Families have people in jail. So this guy's an awful, awful pickle. I don't think he's going to make it, to be honest with you. But, uh, you know, uh, if this is the guy, have him charged. Don't let your elderly be robbed for absolutely no darn reason at all. This is a very rare opportunity if this is the same guy where he's in somebody's hands that can actually do something about it. So more than likely you have a lawyer. So if, you, if this is the same guy, move.